Okay. Anyway. We're here at the Arizona Truck Driving Championship contest today. Truck Driving Championship. Run up the obstacle course back here. We'll do a pre-trip inspection and then we go ahead and do a written test. The whole event is very exciting. This is one of our Swift drivers right here actually competing right now. This is the one Swift's driving, the Walmart truck right here in front of us. It makes it even that much more difficult driving a competitor's truck. And we have a rookie on the course, Randy Sheehan from Swift Transportation. And the first thing we were required to do was an alley dock. It's pretty much a 45 blind side back. When we pulled out of the alley dock, you had to drop the ICC bumper, try to get it in between those two cones. He's gonna stop there and honk his horn when he wants to be scored. Oh, he missed it. It kinda points out how bad sometimes you really are, but then when you're out on the road, you don't have to worry about running over tennis balls. It really makes you think about it and, and try and do better. He's cutting his steer tire in on the white line there, and I think he actually did pretty good there. <laughs> he got a 45. That's very good. Then when they're moving on over to the barrel over here, you have to hook it enough on the outside without touching the barrel with the rear tandem outside reverse rear on the trailer and not touch the barrel to get in the scoring point on that. Very hard, everybody's having trouble with it. I understand I came pretty close, close enough that I just touched it, which is zero points. He's gonna go right over the top of the barrel, ain't he, Pop? Yep, he just hit it with, yeah, he just hit it with the trailer. Nah, he hit it. He must have touched it. Thirty. He got a thirty on it. That's good. He's going to the railroad crossing stop. You have to be able to stop 15 feet in front of that railroad stop, and the closer you can get without going over, you get points. Now they're going to measure it. <laughs> it's not so much as if you fail this course over here, because remember we're going into the pre-trip stage next. So whatever you lost here, you could gain back up over into the pre-trip. It's important to show our driver skills and let their families come out and see what they do. It also is, does a lot of team building for uh, the relationship between the Department of Public Safety and SWIFT. All in all, it was a very fun time. They tally up the results and it'll go on the ATA website. I'll pull those results and I'll make sure it gets sent to you as soon as they're published. Okay, does this mean you're going to have a parade for me down 75th Avenue? No, I watched you I watched you go around the course. There'll be no parade. <laughs> There'll be no parade on that one, mister. It was a lot of fun. I enjoyed it. I get a free hat. <laughs> <laughs>